Tonight, an animal rights group claims the University of Missouri is breaking the law. The group Beagle Freedom Project says the university is blocking its efforts to learn more about animal testing at the school. ABC 17's Marissa Hollowett spoke to the group's lawyer. Marissa, he says the amount the university is charging the group is way too much. Yeah, Lucas, I spoke to Beagle Freedom Project's lawyer, Daniel Cody, today, who tells me the group requested information about the health and treatment of 179 cats and dogs that are being used for research at the university. He says the school is charging, get this, more than $82,000 for that information. The group says the university is violating Missouri's Sunshine Law because of this. Now, the Sunshine Law says, quote, the public governmental body shall produce the companies use, or the copy excuse me, using employees of the body that result in the lowest amount of charges for search, research, and duplication time, end quote. Coley said that by breaking down the research hours, the university would be charging about $125 per hour, which he says is completely unreasonable. He says the information would be in the public's interest and says that the high cost, he thinks, is the university's way to hide information about its practices. It's a big business. And they have a vested financial interest in, in keeping their activities secret. By trying to charge us uh, $82,000, what they're attempting to do is circumvent the Sunshine Law and thwart our efforts to expose their, what's the veil of secrecy. We also reached out to University of Missouri spokesperson Christian Basie about the lawsuit, who says the university is aware of it but cannot comment on pending litigation. The Beagle Freedom Project says it wants to use the information to identify dogs and cats that could be adopted out post-research.